All right, on this one, I was just trying to catch a napping. Um, if you plug in two, you get just a number back, which means this function is continuous at two. Uh, yeah, so you just plug two in. I, I made it look a little complicated. Maybe you were like a little scared if you saw it, if you're watching the video, but just plug in two and you're gonna get the cubed root, oh, not the cubed root, the square root of six minus one is five, minus two cubed is eight, over four, minus four, plus three. Well, that's just three. And there's your answer, you don't have to do any work for this. Since this function is <laughs> continuous at two, then the limit approaches what it equals, which is the square root of five minus eight over three.